This is what happens when engineers stop caring about rules, budgets, or common sense and just decide to break reality. The Yangwang U9 Extreme, a car so mad it makes Teslas look like kitchen appliances. It's Chinese, it's electric, and it doesn't walk into the world of supercars, it kicks the door clean off its hinges. Let's start with the numbers, because they sound fake. Four electric motors, one on each wheel. Total output, 1,300 horsepower, 0 to 100 in 2 seconds flat. That's not acceleration, that's teleportation with neck pain included. But here's where it gets truly deranged. The U9 doesn't just drive, it jumps. Literally. The car can hop up and down like it's auditioning for a ballet dance. Thanks to something called the Dissusex system, a suspension setup that can move each wheel independently, it can lean, lift, dance, or bounce. Most cars handle bumps. This one fights them. The system can lift the entire car off the ground in milliseconds. It means it can corner flatter than a marble table, break like it's hit a brick wall, and, my personal favorite, drive on three wheels just to show off. The design? Imagine a spaceship melted over a Lamborghini. It's covered in fins, vents, and LEDs that make it look like a rave on wheels. Inside, it's even more bonkers. Screens everywhere. A digital cockpit that looks like the control room of a nuclear submarine. And then there's the soundtrack. Not the boring electric hum you'd expect. No, the U9 uses external speakers to simulate the roar of an engine. You can literally choose your fake exhaust note. Ferrari V12? Sure. Spaceship taking off? Why not? It's part car, part theater production. But here's the thing. Beneath all the lights, screens, and party tricks, the U9 is seriously capable. It weighs nearly two tons, yet it'll embarrass almost anything with a petrol engine. It's ridiculous. It's heavy. It's expensive. But it's also proof that supercars are no longer just Italian toys. The Yang Wang U9 Extreme is what happens when an electric car stops trying to save the planet and starts trying to scare it.